Praise the Lord, beautiful people of God. This morning devotion is entitled God's Provisions by Chantel Dixon. Hear the word of the Lord this morning. Elisha replied to her, how can I help you? Tell me what do you have in your house? 2 Kings chapter 4, verse 2. Three-year-old Buddy and his mom went to church each week to help unload groceries from the food ministry truck. When Buddy overheard his mom telling his grandmother that the delivery truck broke down, he said, oh no, how will they do food ministry? His mom explained that the church would have to raise money to buy a new truck. Buddy smiled. I have money, he said. Leaving the room, he returned with a plastic jar decorated with colorful stickers and filled with coins which amounted to a little over $38. Though Buddy did not have much, God combined his sacrificial offering with gifts from others to provide a new refrigerator truck so that the church could continue serving their community. A small amount offered generously is always more than enough when placed in God's hands. In 2 Kings 4, a poor widow asked the prophet Elisha for financial assistance. He told her to take inventory of her own resources, reach out to her neighbors for help, then follow his instructions. In a miraculous display of provisions, God uses the widow's small amount of oil to fill all the jars she collected from her neighbors. Elisha told her, sell the oil and pay your debts. You and your son can live off what's left. When we focus on what we don't have, we risk missing out on watching God do great things with what we do have. Our reflection for today. When has God multiplied your resources in a miraculous way? When has God used you to combine your resources with the gifts of others to meet a bigger need in your community? Let us pray. Faithful provider, please help me to be mindful and grateful as I faithful manage and share all you have given me. Amen. Once again, I'm going to encourage you to subscribe to this channel and please pass this devotion to five new people and encourage them to subscribe as well. God bless you and you have a great day.